Hi, everybody. I'm Dr. Ellie Stein. And in this short video, I'm going to explain how I became interested in something called molecular hydrogen or hydrogen rich water. I've, it's a supplement that I've recently been trying and I'm going to share my personal experience. Now, if you want to know about the science of what molecular hydrogen is, please go to my recent blog in September 2024 on my webpage. Just go to blogs, type in hydrogen, and it should pop right up. Or watch the sister video to this one where I go a little bit more into the science. This video is just about my personal experience. So it all started in May 2024 when I listened to a podcast in which Alex Tarnava, the inventor and patent holder of one of the most common and easy to use forms of molecular hydrogen, was interviewed by um, Ari Witten on the Energy Blueprint podcast. I almost didn't listen to it because over the decades, I've become aware of numerous types of what I'll call special water, and none of them have really panned out, and the ones I've tried did nothing at all. Luckily, I did listen, because early on in the interview, Alex described the evolutionary importance of hydrogen gas, what hydrogen gas does in the human body, and how central and upstream it is for so many biological processes that I know are critical to health. So he really got my attention and I decided to try the supplement. I started at one tablet a day and after maybe three or four weeks, I went up to two tablets a day and I've now been taking it for about three months. Three months is the time frame within which most of the other supplements I've tried over the years stop working. It's about how long it takes the human body to find a workaround <laughs> when we're trying to push it in a direction it doesn't really want to go. If anything, as I continue with molecular hydrogen, I'm seeing even more benefits. The first thing I noticed, and this was, if I remember correctly, on the second day of taking it, my initial sleep period was longer than usual. I have struggled with sleep a lot, even though I do all the things that I teach. For me, it hasn't been enough to get a really solid, refreshing sleep. And so any change to sleep really got my attention. The next thing I noticed, and this was maybe about a week in, is that my daily energy and stamina which has already improved, got even better. And I notice I'm less likely to have a mid-afternoon dip, so I can just keep going all day. I've been sick so long that I had really forgotten what it's like to wake up refreshed, ready to get out of bed, and approach the day with zest and enthusiasm. Remember, I've been ill with ME and associated diseases for 36 years, most of my adult life. And it's hard to be enthusiastic when you're very fatigued. Now, from a mood and zest perspective, I've honestly never felt better. There are days I notice that I'm smiling and jubilant for no apparent reason. Then, about three to four weeks in, something totally unexpected happened. I suffer from what I've always considered kind of the aches and pains of aging. But of course, in me, the, they've been going on for some time. And all of the antioxidant <clears throat> and anti-inflammatory supplements that I've tried over the years, I do not tolerate at all. They make me worse in very significant ways. So I've never been able to find a good anti-inflammatory supplement. Since I've been on the hydrogen water, my overall body pain is decreased. And when I push myself, say with a long hike, a bike ride or a swim, I don't really have a recovery period. I can just go on with my day. It's pretty remarkable. So what do I do? How do I use the supplement? The tablets are of elemental magnesium. Just an aside, 
If you take other types of magnesium tablets like magnesium citrate, magnesium glycinate, they will not make any molecular hydrogen. It's a totally different animal. So you have to take uh, these special tablets. Basically, um, Alex Tarnava and many scientists worked for several years to develop them so that they would dissolve in water with a high enough concentration of hydrogen gas to be clinically effective. So I typically take two tablets a day, one before breakfast because they're best on an empty stomach and one after my lunch has digested. If I remember, because now most days I'm feeling well, I don't actually stop to think that I might need to take a supplement. Uh, you take it in 500 mils or 16 ounces of room temperature water. So you let it react. The hydrogen is dissolved in, but not interacting with the water and you glug it down before it dissipates. Now, a few times when I've done something really more exerting than normal, I've actually taken a third tablet and it seems like it helped. So I think it's the type of supplement that you can kind of titrate on a day-by-day -day basis to how much you need. The effects are noticeable and consistent enough that if I were on a desert island, I wouldn't want to be without this supplement. That's why I'm telling you about it. If you want to learn more about the science of molecular hydrogen, you can read my blog, but if you want to go straight to the experts, check out the website of the Molecular Hydrogen Institute. They are a group of researchers studying molecular hydrogen and teaching their findings to others. I recently did their level one training course. It was pretty basic. I'm waiting for uh, the higher levels to come out and I plan to take them as well. If you're interested in trying the exact same molecular hydrogen tablets that I take, go to my store page, click on the molecular hydrogen link, and you'll be taken to a store called Drink HRW. That stands for Hydrogen Rich Water. This is the company that Alex Tarnava founded but has subsequently sold. They have a US and Canadian site, so you can use the currency of your choice and you can minimize shipping costs depending where you live. For the sake of full transparency, if you purchase some tablets or any other products on their site using this link, I will get a commission on the sale and I thank you in advance for your support.